Hey guys, Matty Extreme Auto, Caravan Camping, Caravan. Good dust suppression systems. You guys have seen me do the Respa and the uh, dust suppression systems, the DRS systems, the Matic and the Caravans. Um, trying to find time to do a video on one for a while now. Done heaps of these. These are um, really good to keep the dust out. They're basically a thermo fan filtrated under this hatch here. So you take the screws out, it exposes the uh, filter. You remove it, you clean it out, you get a replacement. There's a big thermo fan in there, which I'll, I'll take you inside and show you how it works. Pretty simple stuff. This one we've done here um, in the position where there would be a rooftop AC. Um, they're not overly heavy. They're only a few kilos, so you can look up the specs online, but um, we've kept this in a nice straight line, as you can see. It's up on the roof here. Uh, the supports run either side of it. So horizontally running, there's a support here and here. And the 360 cutout that would be there for the AC or if this had a rooftop AC, uh, that was that's there to support that. But these are don't really need a lot of roof support because they're so lightweight. Um, but the idea behind it is if you've got sandwiching, so when you do your cutout, if your roof has... Um, you know, nothing in between it. You do have to pack it out and space it out with a timber frame. In this case, the frame was either side of it, so it wasn't required. So if you can line up your cutout when you do it, right in the middle of your your supports, you you, you can actually pick up the supports with these end screws. They just reach. Uh, well, in, in this corner, it did anyway. So turn it on, eh? Sounds like a jet engine, doesn't it? It's a thermo fan. You know, what's on, what's your ret retro fit to your... You know, radiator kits, Davis Craig or something, I don't know the brand of the actual fan, but Carafan guys, they do a bloody good job. They're up there in price, but I'll tell you what, like, they're, they're just a good company to do it, and you know, we fit lots of the things. Just uh, happy to be able to put a cheeky video out there for you guys to show you what they do. And that's as simple as it is. And when you wire it up, uh, try not to, well, I try and tell people when they do wire them up, if you did it yourself, Put it on a constant power circuit. Don't have it on your battery switch, like in this one here is the BN Pro, okay? So if I turn that off, which is, you know, shutting the lights down and all the 12 volt circuits, I can still run it. Now the, the idea behind that is if you're in transit and you want to shut your battery down because you don't need it on, you know, you're not running lights and stuff, well, you can do this. You can keep the caravan cranking and still, you know, pressurizing your van. And then when you arrive on site, you just simply hit your button and, there's all your lights. There you go, guys. Caravan on a pop top.